So let's start sanitize. This is um, gonna have to do with SQL queries, I'm pretty sure. So I'm gonna hit copy here, move this over. Notice that when I click that, it says Docker host copied. So that's how I know these, these machines with a public IP are Docker containers. Plus they spawn super fast compared to, to like full virtual machine targets. So we're on um, Pwnbox, which is Bay. I really love Pwnbox. And then I'm going to paste in the host. We're getting to the web page and we have a sign in page. So this sign in, it just says SQLI. So they're not hiding that. This is more of just a practicing those things. So what do we do here? Can we try? What should we try? So one of the things that I would try is um, I would pull up a site called Payload All the Things, right? So we could do like Payload. We, let's do it from Pwnbox. We'll do like uh, Payload All the Things. And I do like the recent changes they've made to Pwnbox. It kind of looks a little bit more stylish and sleek. So we're going to Payload All the Things. And we're looking for SQL stuff. You're going to want to bookmark this site. This is a very useful site. Or if you have your an ongoing instance of a hacking distro that you play with when you're on Hack the Box, I would recommend you do um, like clone this. Git clone. And then there's a link you can get with any GitHub repo. So my SSQL injection, cheat sheets, my SQL. And we, I guess we could try to use uh, like automated tools like SQL map, which would try to do this stuff automatically. But let's try this via just manual manually inputting the injection commands here. So so you can do like SQL injection through through login form. Oops. I was wondering while testing my website that, that is there any way that the user can fetch data from my database by making some further modification in the following query. So we could, you know, try these. We could try that there. It's not letting me paste in. I don't want to type that all out. I mean, on the web form, we could admin this. Oh, so they're trolling. <laughs> Must learn to tink outside the box. Man, killing me, man. Killing me, man. Boom, or... One equals one. Ooh. That gave me a flag. And I'm, I'm literally trying these things, the payload, all the things, right? You know, because you're injecting these commands are actually issuing SQL queries on the other end because 
Why? Because the user, the username and password exists inside of a database on the other end of that. Databases are underrated. Let's be real. Like databases as a IT mechanism, as a technology, a foundational technology to the way that things work are underrated. You know, I mean, you don't have an Amazon without databases, right? You don't have a hack the box without databases. You don't have without databases. Like, I don't even know what I meant by that. But you know where I was going. Like, I could list every single website that has any significance. So we got us, we got us a flag right here, boys. So, yes, I am going to grab that flag. And what did I do? I did admin. Yes, I did this right here. That's what I did. It did an SQL injection. Boom, I got the flag. So, we got a flag. Let's go ham with that. And we're going to, where am I? I'm right here. Submit the flag. I just, just. No, I just put like anything. Like I just typed like one, two, three or something to just have something in that space. Piece of cake. Yeah. Very easy. It wasn't quite as easy as the last one because I had to go look stuff up. That feeling is so good right there.